Jeep Grand Cherokee transmission over temp. What does it mean? Causes and fixes. The Jeep Grand Cherokee is a great vehicle, but like any car, it's not perfect. One of the most common problems that Jeep Grand Cherokee owners face is the transmission overheating. Transmission overheating can cause a lot of damage to your vehicle. It can cause the transmission fluid to break down, which can lead to expensive repairs or even replacement. Transmission overheating can also cause the gears to seize up, which can be very dangerous. Fortunately, there are a few things that you can do to prevent your Jeep Grand Cherokee's transmission from overheating. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Auto V Fix. We bring you exciting topics about automobiles and provide lucid explanations on car-related issues and their essential components. We share helpful and professional tips to help you maintain your vehicle. In this video, we'll cover the most common causes of transmission overheating and what you can do to fix them. What is the ideal transmission temperature for Jeep Grand Cherokee? Your transmission is responsible for transferring power from the engine to the wheels. Transmission fluid helps keep the transmission cool and lubricated, which is necessary for proper functioning. The ideal transmission temperature for a Jeep Grand Cherokee is between 175 and 200 degrees Fahrenheit. However, it's important to note that this range is only for normal driving conditions. If you're driving in stop-and-go traffic or in extreme heat, your transmission temperature may rise above 200 degrees. That's why it's important to have a good transmission cooler installed in your Jeep Grand Cherokee. If you don't have a transmission cooler, or if your transmission cooler is not working properly, your transmission temperature could quickly climb to dangerous levels. That's why it's important to have your Jeep Grand Cherokee's transmission checked regularly by a qualified mechanic. They will be able to tell you if your transmission is running at the correct temperature and make recommendations on how to keep it running at its best. What does Jeep Grand Cherokee transmission over temp means? Here's what you need to know about transmission over temperature in Jeep Cherokees. First, it's important to understand that there are two different types of transmissions, automatic and manual. Automatic transmissions have a fluid coolant system that helps keep the transmission working properly and prevent overheating. Manual transmissions don't have a fluid coolant system so they can overheat more easily. That's why the message transmission over temp is more likely to pop up in a Jeep Cherokee with a manual transmission. If your Jeep has an automatic transmission, you might see the message if you're doing a lot of stop and go driving in hot weather. But as long as you're not driving too long in stop and go traffic, you shouldn't have to worry about your transmission overheating. If you do see the transmission over temp message, it's important to take action right away. The first thing you should do is pull over and turn off your engine. Once your engine is off, open the hood and let your Jeep cool down for at least 30 minutes. Once your Jeep has cooled down, check the transmission fluid level and add more fluid if necessary. What causes Jeep Grand Cherokee transmission over temp and how to fix is 1. Not enough transmission fluid. One of the most common causes of transmission overheating is not enough transmission fluid. When your Jeep Grand Cherokee doesn't have enough transmission fluid, it has to work harder to move the gears, which causes it to overheat. To fix this problem, you'll need to add more transmission fluid to your Jeep Grand Cherokee. You can find the transmission fluid dipstick under the hood. Just follow the yellow cap. Add transmission fluid until it reaches the full line on the dipstick. If you're unsure of what kind of transmission fluid to use, consult your owner's manual or ask a mechanic. Using the wrong type of transmission fluid can actually make the problem worse. 2. Old or dirty transmission fluid. Another common cause of transmission overheating is old or dirty transmission fluid. Over time, transmission fluid breaks down and becomes less effective at lubricating and cooling the gears. This causes the gears to work harder and overheat. To fix this problem, you'll need to flush your Jeep Grand Cherokee's transmission system and replace the old fluid with fresh, clean fluid. You can do this yourself or take it to a mechanic. 3. Faulty solenoid. One possible cause of transmission over temperature is a faulty transmission solenoid. The solenoid is responsible for controlling the flow of transmission fluid, and if it isn't working properly, the fluid can overheat. 
you'll need to have a certified mechanic check your transmission solenoid to see if it needs to be replaced. 4. Weather conditions. Another possible cause of transmission over temperature is driving in extreme weather conditions. If it's extremely hot or cold outside, this can put extra strain on your transmission and cause it to overheat. Try to avoid driving in extreme weather conditions if possible, or take extra care of your transmission by having it serviced regularly. 5. Cooling System Issues The third most common cause of transmission overheating is cooling system issues. Your Jeep Grand Cherokee's cooling system is responsible for keeping the transmission cool by circulating coolant through it. If there's a problem with the cooling system, the coolant won't be able to do its job and the transmission will overheat. 6. False over temp message. There are a few different things that can cause the false overheating message in Jeep Grand Cherokees. The most common cause is actually physical damage to the transmission temperature sensor. This sensor is located near the transmission fluid cooler and it's responsible for sending data to the vehicle's computer about the transmission fluid temperature. If this sensor is damaged, it can cause the computer to misinterpret the data and trigger the overheating message. Another common cause is software issues. In some cases, an error in the software that controls the transmission temperature sensor can cause the same false overheating message. This is typically caused by an incorrect calibration of the sensor or a problem with the software itself. Fortunately, this type of issue can usually be resolved with a simple software update from your Jeep dealer. Finally, extreme outside temperatures can also cause the false overheating message. This is because the transmission fluid expands when it gets hot, which can cause pressure buildup in the system and trigger the message. However, this is not really an issue because the transmission fluid will cool down once you turn off the engine and allow it to rest for a bit. 7. Towing a heavy load. If you're regularly using your Jeep Grand Cherokee to tow a heavy load, this can also lead to transmission over temperature. Whenever possible, try to reduce the weight of the load you're towing so that your transmission doesn't have to work as hard. You should also have your Jeep's transmission serviced more often when you're doing a lot of towing. 8. Engine is running too hard. If your engine is running too hard, it can cause the engine to overheat. This can be a serious problem as an overheated engine can lead to engine failure. There are a few things that can cause your engine to run too hard, so it's important to be aware of them. First, if you're driving in hot weather, your engine will have to work harder to keep cool. Second, if you're stuck in traffic or idling for long periods of time, your engine will also have to work harder. Finally, if you're carrying a heavy load or pulling a trailer, your engine will have to work harder than usual. If you notice that your engine is starting to overheat, pull over and let it cool down for a few minutes. If the problem persists, call a tow truck or mechanic as soon as possible. 9. Leak in the seals or gaskets. When a transmission overheats, it is usually due to a leak in the seals or gaskets. These seals and gaskets are designed to keep fluid in and contaminants out. Over time, they can become worn or damaged, allowing fluid to leak out and contamination to enter the system. This can cause the transmission to overheat, resulting in damage to the internal components. In some cases, an overheating transmission may simply need to be refilled with fresh fluid. However, if the seals or gaskets are damaged, they will need to be replaced in order to prevent future leaks. I appreciate your time to watch that interesting and educative video. I am sure you have got value. Kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on the bell to be the first to get notified when we drop a new video. Catch you all next time.